hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is amanda nukana this is my channel life of course if you are new here welcome i post plus size style and fashion tips as well as healthy body positive content that's always a mouthful to say anyway so today's video is me basically showing you guys what i got from shein my package finally arrived i am going to be taking you through my whole shein journey from when i ordered when it arrived customs the company that they used and then of course i'm going to be showing you guys what it is that i got and how it looks on my body Please note that I got the package yesterday, which was the 15th of July, and I basically tried on everything. So what I look like now is not what I look like yesterday. Don't mind the setup, okay? I did bath. I am fresh. It's just one of those Saturdays where I'm just going to be in the gown the whole day. Okay, so for those of you who don't know, Shein is a Chinese online fast fashion retail store basically i don't know store warehouse i don't know really what they are um but they sell fast fashion on trend clothes really nice things for cheap 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 okay like when i say cheap i mean she is quite affordable so i placed my order on the first of july at night this was like around 10 11 o'clock and my package arrived on the 15th of um july 2022 <laughs> and customs was paid on the 5th of um july so that's about like two weeks two and a half weeks in total um obviously they don't work on weekends and public holidays the company that they used was buffalo logistics which is actually one of my favorite companies um everything of these is so fast they send you the link for um paying customs everything is just on point so with regards to my order somebody told me that when you pay when you order less than 1400 1500 you don't pay customs so i was like let me give this a try that's a lie you will always pay customs don't tell yourself you're not going to pay customs keep money aside to pay customs so i ordered clothes with 1200 rand and i got a 10 discount which brought my whole total to 1700 no 1078 rand um that's with discount wait why is my math not mathing <laughs> what's happening <laughs> yeah and then i paid 112 rand for customs so in total i paid like 1180 or something like that um for 12 items from Shein. The first item that I got was this phone case. And honestly, my iPhone is green, but I can't really show you guys because I'm using it to film right now. And this is what this looks like. It's just like a nice um iPhone cover, very cute, very nice. I can't wait to put it on my phone. And then I got um a pair of sunglasses. And it comes packaged like this. It actually came packaged in this and then this. And then you open this up and it comes in another packaging. But what? So for me, it's just like, oh, wow. I love how detailed they are and whatever. And these are like, you know, this is how the sunglasses look. I will say I am a bit disappointed by the tint. I thought it would be a little bit more orange. Um, The feel of these sunglasses is quite plastic. Like, I'm not going to lie. I feel like sunglasses that are meant for like a kid somewhere on here i read um it says fashion glasses not to be worn outside to protect the eyes against strong sunlight so why am i what what is the purpose of them being sun where am i supposed to wear these because of the sun to protect again sunglasses the sun to protect a, i'm sorry do i not know english like it's fine, Sheen. I guess I'll just wear them for pictures. I don't know. Okay. And then after that, I got myself three pairs of um, earrings. So I'm just going to put the picture somewhere up there. I got these gold um, hoops. I'm a sucker for gold hoops. Like I, I say this and I've said this in my earring haul as well. I am a whore for hoops. And I'm not taking that back. And then I got these white um, hoops. I don't know if you guys will be able to see them. But I just felt like I really wanted like old school retro hoops. And this is what it looks like. Just like your basic hoop. 
um, yeah. And then I got these ones, which look like you're wearing three earrings. They, these, um, they're a little bit bigger than what I expected. Now that that's done, let's get into the um, actual clothes. So this is what the clothes come in. They're very well packaged and you can just like unzip this. Um, the first top that I'm going to be showing you guys is this black top. Here's the picture and here's what I look like in it. Absolutely gorgeous. My oh, gorgeous. <laughs> My only complaint is this is what the back looks like. This back is so tiny. I'm asking myself where were they expecting my back fat to sit on a string? This is what, excuse me, what is this? And if you look in this video, I'm showing you guys as well. But the back for me, the back, the who, the who, okay. Next item is this red top. Listen, I've been wanting this red top for the... I've been wanting this red top for the longest time. I feel like my wardrobe lacks color. And now that I'm growing, for some reason, I'm finding myself gravitating towards more colorful things. Like, I feel like people need to see me in my fat black body. And color is the only way to do it. Like, I'm sorry. Let me be colorful and fat. I don't know why. Like, black will always have my heart. But these days, I am gravitating towards color. And I'm not ashamed of it. Anyway, and just so you guys know, the quality of this is like something that I would say you could find that cotton on. I was not expecting it. Not that I'm downplaying Shein, but I was expecting the quality to be like, okay, because the prices, I was just like, oh, wow. Like, thank you, Shein. And then the next item that I got was a black skirt. This is what it looks like on the app. This is what it looks like on me. And literally... I don't think I have ever been happier. I do feel like though this skirt I will have to hand wash because I am concerned about the type of material. It's like a cotton material and I feel like the washing machine is going to cause it to have onjonji. I don't know what onjonji is in English. Um, when your clothes get the little balls on them. What is that? What do you call the balls? But that's why I feel like you need to hand wash it because... I'm skeptical. Do I ever hand wash my stuff? No. I still live at home. I'm going to ask my mom. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, um, I feel like the quality though is amazing. It feels so soft. I feel like, you know how I would describe the feeling of this? You know that toilet paper brand where the puppy is chasing the toilet paper and the puppy just looks so soft and fluffy? This is what that feels like. I don't know what that dog feels like, but I feel like if I had to touch that dog, it would feel like this. It feels so, I just wanna, it feels amazing. On the inside, it has a lining. I was not expecting a lining. I don't know why, I, I feel like I'm being so rude to Sheen and downplaying them, but I really was not expecting a lining on the inside. So the lining makes it a bit more thicker and the lining is a different material to the outside. Ah, I love it. And it's so, I don't know what it is. I don't know what this material is and yeah but it's a nice material it's like a like an under rocky the ones that your grandma wears that like a i can't find my words but you know what i'm talking about okay and then the next item that i got was this mini skirt this mini skirt was so cheap so i just thought let me just add one more item to my cart because why not and this is what it looks like um the material though i will say i am a bit disappointed in it but for the price I'm not that disappointed. It is a little like, it's not see-through, see-through, but I can see the ring light like this, you know? I can actually see the shape of the ring light. I can see, yeah, I can see it. But it's not light. Like, I don't know how to describe it. I got this in a very big size compared to my normal size, only because I feel like the fact that it is a mini skirt was a bit already like out of my comfort zone. But then also for me to get it in a smaller size with how big my bum is, I like look never. So yeah, that's why I got it in a 4XL and I'm very happy that I did get it in a 4XL. The only thing that I need to do is just tailor it, make it tighter around the waist. Other than that, I'm very happy with this skirt. I feel like you can wear this skirt alone or now in the winter time. And I'm feeling like I already have an outfit. I already have an idea. You guys will see it up on my Instagram. 
when I eventually do wear this skirt because I know what I'm going to wear this skirt with. The material itself is very nice. I thought this material would be a little bit more um, like tweed-like. I don't know if you look at the picture, I thought it was like a tweedish skirt or something. But this feels more like the material that you make um, almost like a swimming costume material, but not yet like a swimming costume material. You know, like it's swimming costume material adjacent. And now I'm down to my last two items. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but I thought because I'm ordering from Shein, I am not going to order all the way from China and order basic clothes. Everything that I ordered is stuff that I can wear when I'm going out. Because I was just like, I can't order stuff that feels like I could have gotten it at Mr. Price. Well, it kind of does feel like Mr. Price could replicate these clothes, but at the same time, when, you know? So the last item that I got well, it's not actually the last. The second last item that I got is a brown dress. This is what it looks like on the site. And this is what it looks like on me. And this is what it looks like on camera. Like with me holding it. This material is swimming costume material. No one can tell me anything else. It is swimming costume material. Again, I was... Uh, who doesn't want me to speak? I was forcing things with this... Um, size. Because this is a large. And I couldn't find this dress in like the bigger sizes i was like ah and i literally was clenching in my ass because i was like i really want this dress to fit me and when i was putting it on yesterday i was like you will fit me and it did it really did so yeah i am going to say though i'm not really happy with where the arms um sit on me i feel like i wish it just came up a little bit you know over here it's not that bad like it's not that visible i think i hope um, it does come with like this little stretch thing over the arms. I don't know if you can see this is the arm and then, you know, I wish the arm was a bit more like, you know, spacious or wider, but I'm not mad because the material itself is quite stretchy. It's a very stretchy material like this can definitely fit someone who is an extra large because I'm an extra large. I even go up to a 2XL. The only problem would be the arms because the rest of the dress, I, it is serving body, yaddy, yaddy. But the arms, I'm not, yeah, the, the arms are doing what the arms are doing. But otherwise, I'm very happy. I was also skeptical about choosing a chocolate colored dress for my chocolate skin. I didn't like, you know, I was hoping it wouldn't wash me away. But yeah, I'm very happy with it. Okay, and then now the last item and the most expensive item was this summer dress. This is what it looks like on the app. This is what it looks like on me. And this is, I love this dress so much. I love it. I love it more than I love my firstborn child who has not yet been born. I love this dress so effing much. This is what it looks like with me holding it. I will say, I think I am someone, guys, who wears glasses. I do have eye problems, but I could have sworn on the app this dress was brown. Look at this picture and tell me, does that, does that not look brown? Because I thought I was ordering a shades of brown dress, but it's fine. Anyway, so this is what the color actually looks like. It's red, yellow, dun 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 ni wow wow ruir ruir. Okay, cool. It's fine. I like how the dress sits on me. I do want to like just get the waist cinched in a little bit more. It does come with a zip at the back. So the dress is made to look like a two-piece in the front, as you guys can see. And then at the back, it's like a full-on closed dress um with a bit of the top open. I was um feeling like maybe I should get it trimmed a bit at the bottom because although i like maxi dresses i don't like it when my dress actually touches the floor with regards to that i just always feel like now the next time i wear it regardless of whether i've washed it or not is it not going to look so dirty with like that dirty floor trimming everywhere i walk i'm picking up all the nonsense that's on the floor we're not gum we're not chocolate wrappers we're not don't, don't, no that's not for me it's not my life <laughs> that's not my portion anyway so yeah anyway otherwise i'm very happy with this dress 10 out of 10 for me i love how it sits on me obviously the only other thing that i would have complained about is the color the material itself feels sort of linen like but i don't know if this is what linen feels like because i do have linen stuff but this looks like linen but it's hard doesn't feel it's like a hard but it's soft at the same time. But it's quite a quite a man. But then I land our way to and as I don't know. But on the site they don't really describe it as linen, do they? I really don't know. But anyway, whatever. 
okay guys so that is the end of this video thank you guys so much for watching this video please don't forget to like comment and subscribe also check me out on all my social media accounts i actually only have two accounts now it is ig and my tiktok i have tiktok so <laughs> go give your girl a follow i'm going to link both um accounts down below um what else is there see you guys in my next video i will be back with more hauls and outfit ideas i work from home now so i have more than enough time to do youtube anyway <laughs> see you guys in my next video as always i'm sending peace and love from my heart to yours guys you know i love you lots like jelly tots Mwah!